Greetings, I'm Dr. Walter Jacobson, a board-certified psychiatrist. So I was uh, driving on the freeway the other day, and uh, there was this. I'm on the I'm in the uh, far right lane, and uh, this person's in front of me driving, and uh, he was signaling that he wanted to move into the left lane, and it was clear the guy wanted to move into the left lane. And the guy uh, in the lane he wanted to move into, there was somebody uh, in the, behind him, and actually behind me. There was a huge amount of space. And this person started speeding up. Now, he saw the person wanting to move into the left lane, into the left lane and he, there was so much space there. He started to speed up, accelerated, and zoomed up, to the, so, so making it impossible for this person to move into the lane. You know, and uh, had he just maintained his speed and let the person move into the lane, it would have been like a pretty neighborly thing to do, an appropriate thing to do. And it just struck me as so incredibly petty and thoughtless and mean. It was a form of an attack. It's actually an attack. It's saying, like, I recognize that uh, that you wanted to do this and I'm going to be incredibly inconsiderate and uh, and greedy and selfish and I'm going to, you know, uh, uh, cut you off so you'll have to go behind me and I'll have saved uh, three seconds uh, out of my life. Uh, it's, it's really not cool. So, uh, you know, road behavior, it speaks volumes about who you are. And, uh, and even though it's true that many people who engage in road rage behavior, uh, for the most part, don't behave that way in regular life, the, the cars uh, and roads uh, seem to bring out uh, the worst in us in a lot of ways. Nonetheless, this one example is, is an example of inconsiderateness, and we need to be more considerate. The world needs to be more patient, more considerate, more thoughtful, and uh, more of service to each other. And this was an opportunity for this guy to just be cool and let this other person in and feel good about himself for cooperating uh, on the planet rather than uh, using this as an opportunity to act out, an opportunity to be aggressive and to, uh, to what? It's a, it's, it's a battle of egos out there. And the ego says, no, I'm not going to let this person in. I, you know, I want to win. I want to be ahead. I want to be first. I, I want to be recognized as special and important. It's all so petty and foolish and meaningless. The only thing that is meaningful is getting along with each other. The only thing that's meaningful is trying to cooperate, trying to be compassionate, trying to be accepting, uh, trying to compromise, trying to be fair and just for the greatest good of all concerned. So think about that the next time you're on a freeway and you have a choice, you know, take the high road. All right, take care. Peace be with you. See you next time.